Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video. Tonight, I want to do a video on plans for your base and where to get the most plans you can, the best plans if you will, uh, where you can get them. So first things first, um, th you will get the cheapest plans at player vendors, assuming that the players aren't trying to rip people off. So most plans uh, will sell between a couple of hundred, which is a fair price depending on what they are. I think I mispriced them too, but whatever. Um, so you see one here, it's a small letter set, I don't even know what that is. But when I put it into the store, it's recommended I put it at a thousand. But I've got two of them and I put them at 250 each, I don't even know what they are. Um, then I put some other stuff in. So these are your heavy armor plans. Now, personally, I don't mind spending less than a thousand on these because that's a fair price for just. Um, I don't even know why that's so much. I should put it at ten. Uh, whatever. Uh, recipes about fifty coins each. Apart from like the super stim packs because they are. Um, Incredibly useful for healing yourself. Bobblehead's about 150 to 200. Uh, and I'm pretty sure I'm the only person in any lobby that sells um, crafting materials. But they do sell, because I guess people need them. So, if you're just looking for uh, places to buy stuff from, if you hover over someone's base, it tells you there the plans. So this guy's got 40 plans. So it's going to cost me 4 caps to travel to him. But if he was in my group, it wouldn't cost me anything. I could just fast travel. I'm going to travel to this guy's camp and see what he's got. But I already know quite a lot of plans. Um, so the chances of him having any that I won't know is probably slim. Um... And the ones that I'd need to know <laughs> usually cost quite a bit if I was going to, going to go to a robot vendor. And just, just, excuse me, I just need to heal myself with water. Right, where's this guy? Is it? You don't tell him, but I'm going to call his stuff. I'm assuming all this stuff's here for me. <laughs> la la la. Oh, nothing in there. Yoink. Um. Uh, this guy got no honey. I can't. So his vending machines are here. Uh, you want to skip across to uh, notes. This guy's got fairly decent prices. All right. So what we got? We got a half of the stuff. Half of the writing's missing, so you can't really tell what it is. Baseball bat. Baseball bat. Searing. I guess that's a mod for a baseball bat. Um, uh, campfire Tales Tent. Uh, so they are, they are all actually um, relatively decent prices. Because I don't own them, I'm going to buy them. So this one here is 10, it's 2. But I want to be careful, I'll just buy one instead of two. Same with this uh, lead lined arm. So I might have just stole all the guy's fruit and whatnot, but he's making some caps. You don't need to worry. You got any honey anyway? I like me some honey. And I'll even fix this fertilizing thing because I'm K 
kind. <laughs> I've never robbed him. Um, yeah, so when you've done that, uh, if you follow the trade tracks, you'll see these little train icons. These are all the vendors, robot vendors around the map. These guys do not move and they do have different um, plans when you go from each one. Uh, but I think the best place. Let's see if he's, good. he's got 79 plans. Yeah. Let's go to him first. It's going to cost me 39 caps to get it. I wish there was a perk for cheaper travel. Uh, the robot vendors do have good plans, uh, but for the most part, they just like night vision scopes or stuff like that. Uh, the really good stuff, I'm going to show you where really really good stuff is. Uh, if you just bear with me two seconds, because the loading screens are ridiculous. Have you ever seen the rain? Come on! You literally could learn a musical instrument while waiting for this. Maybe it's me, I'm just impatient. You expect with better Xboxes to have like faster times where it just seems to slow down 90% of the time. Hi guy. Oh, it's a bit basically gonna spawn. Oh dear, am I gonna be inside it? Don't know. Look at it all. I, I assure you that's not what his base looks like, it's just loading in slowly, because... <laughs> I feel like if I went back on 360, it'd be better than this. <laughs> I do like that wood pattern though, that's fantastic. So when I, I spawned at this guy's base, it didn't actually um, spawn me in front of it, it spawned me like inside the walls and everything. So I don't want to be doing that because that's stealing. Uh, where's the... Open, so I'm guessing the uh, vendor. See why he dropped them. Drops them because they're crap. Uh, like, notes. So this guy's even got better prices, huh? On some stuff, huh? Like this head. 25, I've seen that as high as like 5,000, so I'm gonna buy that. Um, but before I do, I'm gonna learn the plans I do know, so if we go to notes, says I already know some there. You always make, want to make sure you know the, like you've got no plans in your inventory because you could just be buying the same ones over and over again. Then if you go down further, your um, recipes would be under R because it's alphabetical order. Price for a jumpsuit, but see, that's not bad. A thousand for a rocket launcher. See, I've better nails, I've seen it as low as 500, and I've seen it as high as 10,000. So, you, you, you gotta like shop around. This guy, I know, how I can nick. <laughs> A lot of people start putting their food in like greenhouses or on roofs and no one can take them. <laughs> I don't blame them. Uh, right, so what you want to do is go to this White Springs Resort. 
I'm going to show you the best vendors that I've seen. There may be better ones on the game, but this is the best one that I have seen. Uh, with the largest amount of plans you can find and the best overall that will help you long term, not just cosmetically doing your camp up, but like uh, for your mech suits, your weapons and all that, not just yeah, like your light weapons, even your heavy weapons. See what's happening in the world of Pokemon Go while this is loading. Bit tame, but I've got to go through this door, which is going to put me on another loading screen. So, <laughs> they seriously do need to do something about this load, uh, the loading screens because it's like the half the time it's just a loading screen. In other news, I have just found a squirtle on my garden. So this place can... It's like a maze. Um, so what you're going to do is go through the front door like I just did, come downstairs, go to your right, and there's all these different stores and they've all got a different uh, robot in them and um, they all sell different things so if we just go to plants because that's what we want uh, says this guy's got no plants oh, okay. guess he just sells some other stuff another one here uh, no, it's not, he's not selling any either Right, so let's just cut the crap out and just go to the weapons. So if you look for this guy here with a bear rug on the floor, and the bear there. There's two vendors, they both sell different things. This is a Brotherhood vendor. So if you press X on it, go across to notes. See all these lovely, lovely plans. So you can buy the uh, Gatling laser. Uh, Grenade launcher, auto grenade launcher, sorry. Um, and many, many other things plasma gun, revolver, uh, mech suit upgrades. And there's so many of them. Then, if you go to this guy, this Cunningham. Yes, yeah, sir. Upper lip and all that shite. So that that's the best skin rug you can buy off this guy. Oh, did I bash you? I didn't mean to bash you. He does that sometimes, and <laughs> it scares me like he's gonna tear on blum head off. So yeah, that's the best skin rug. He's got three of them. Don't know why he's got three of them, but whatever. Um, come out of here. There's another. So, like this entire thing is just full of uh, awesome plans. So, I don't really care for the black powder pistols, I'll probably buy them eventually, but it's not something I use often. Although they are quite powerful, but they are slow as hell to reload. And this guy's got more auto rocket launcher for nearly 4k. You just gotta find what you want. Like, I've seen people more powerful than me who don't even use mech suits. Um, so you've gotta like have a vision in your head of what kind mm -hmm. of player you wanna be. Um, do you wanna be the tank or do you wanna be like a guy who 
um, just does all the damage or takes all the damage. Anyway, that's the video. I apologise for being 15 minutes long, but uh, if you need the location again, it's White Springs Resort. You can't find vendors um, anywhere there's a, a station. If you, if you currently don't have any stations unlocked, just run the train tracks. I probably only found all of them, uh, but you will find quite a lot. Uh, usually about, I'd say, five minutes apart. There's probably somewhere around there that I haven't got, because there's one there, and there's one there. There's got to be one in between. Um, some outposts have traders. There are wandering traders as well. Um, but I think that's it, guys. Uh, I would highly recommend... Uh, do doing this watch the video I've made on getting the max amount of caps per day uh, when you've got about 5,000 go to one station buy as much as you can like completely buy all the plans learn them all so you don't have to go to that uh, station again go to another station do the exact same thing then concentrate on the bigger places like White Springs and you'll find that in no time all you will have everything you want um, but I would also recommend you go to player vendors first because they are a lot cheaper um, anyway that's the video hope it helps I'll catch you next time